cosa. Hello, Lucero. Good evening. How are you? Hello, good evening, teacher. Um, I'm fine. I was, I was a uh, take a nap for five, for fifty minutes. And you? Well, you know, working as usual, running some errands today in the afternoon. I have to go down to San Salvador. I don't really like that. Then back home and just doing some stuff here. Still a lot of work. Do too. you do you tire? A little bit, not that much, but you know it's a long night for me because I gotta work after. Actually, I still got a lot of work to do after this class. Okay, I'm glad for you, teacher. Uh, yeah, that's the way it goes. Thank you very much and welcome to the class. Thank you. Marta, hello, Marta. Hi, teacher, good evening. Good evening, Marta. You left me yesterday, tell me why. Teacher, because in my work, at, uh, I have a, a many process for um, migration, the companies. So, uh, I worked yesterday at uh, two, 2 a.m. around 2, oh, really? 2 a.m. Ouch. Yes. <laughs> but late. you know, it's my work. <laughs> uh, that's the way it goes. That's the way it yes. goes. That's not Maybe normal. tomorrow is the same. Oh, really? Yes. So you're having a hard week? Yes, very hard, teacher. But I am ready for the class, teacher. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. It's always good to be ready for class. What about you? Well, you know, here, busy, busy, as usual. A lot of work to do. <laughs> Actually, I have to create a new group for parents, I need to create a, a, a program for another class that I'm going to teach on Sundays, and I need to send that information to my students, and I need to check out which material I'm going to teach because that person is uh, is going to get enrolled into a SIM. So I'm going to prepare a student for, for the test that they undertake at the SIM. Okay. And Friday, I have to prepare another material because Friday night, a friend of mine is coming over to stay at my house because his wife's got an exam on Saturday and he, they want me to help her study. Oh my God. So. Are you very busy too? Yes, I am. I am. I am. How but do you, you feel? Know, a Yes, tell me. How do you feel the your hands? My hand. Yes. Actually, right now it's hurting a little bit because um, last Sunday I went to get my my COVID vaccine, the third doses. Three and doses. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah, third doses, <laughs> and and I have uh, gotten a lot of uh, symptoms. You know. Heart. I've been running a fever, I have had a headache. I've been like this since yesterday. Oh my God. Be careful, so teacher. Yeah, you know, it's just the effects of the vaccine. So that's normal. Yes, the virus is very dangerous. Yeah. Well, Martha, hello. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you teacher. Much. Welcome. Chanira, hello, how are you? 
Hello, teacher. How are I'm you? Good. I'm good. I just work, but I'm ready for the class too. I'm sure. Oh, really? And how was your day? What did you do today? Well, it was a normal day, you know, the same story. Uh, so some cases. Well, this day I I received a call very late, uh, six, <clears throat> and was a uh, uh, weird case because I need to check uh, a lot of things for some of these guys, but. Now is it's okay. I very close to close my my day. Then I'm I'm okay. And you, teacher? Well, you know, working, running some errands. I was talking to Marta, and the only bad thing is that I have uh, I have been feeling the symptoms of the vaccine. Oh yes. It's because I, really I took my I took my third doses on last Sunday, so I've been like uh, you know, well actually last night I was running a fever. I was with a fever yesterday since like four p.m. Oh yes, even uh, even during the class I was not that good. Yeah. Marta get his uh, second dosis yesterday. Who? Marta. Oh really? Yeah. No, I she... got the third. I got the third one. Oh. I got the third one. So. Oh, when I one. when I, when I get my first and my second doses, I don't feel nothing. Me neither. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't, yes, I didn't. Yeah, me neither. For the first and the second, nothing at all. Not a problem. Oh, Jesus, my third doses is in November. But the third one for me has been like a terrible. Oh my gosh. But we'll see, I mean, it will pass. Yeah, yeah. It's better, it than, the, the, it's better than the virus. Yeah, the virus, virus. The virus yeah, yeah, sure. But yesterday was terrible because I got I got pain in my joints. In your joint? What does what does mean joints? Articulaciones. Um so yesterday I had pain on my joints and that's terrible. And fever teacher? Yes, I was running a fever yesterday since like around 4 p.m. all night long, today in the morning. The headache, and headache? Yes, yesterday it was terrible. Oh, Jesus. Even during the class, I was with a heavy, heavy headache. I, I hope that I, uh, no, no, I sent it. What do you say? No, I sent it. I, I. You won't feel. You won't feel. I won't feel any symptoms when I get my two doses. Let's hope so. Yeah, I, I, I hope. <laughs> yeah, because I mean this thing is terrible. But as I you say, it. It is better than the than catching the virus. Yes, of course, teacher. Yes, of course. Okay. Let me see. Let's see. Well, thank you very much, Janina. Nice talking to you. Thank you, teacher. Okay, let's see. Let me text. Let's see. Let me just send a text to remind everybody that we are in class because there are some of you who are 
has no jet in class. Let's see, we are missing two. Mm -hmm. Daniel, Nathaniel, Nicholas, Walter, that's bigger. Okay, guys, let's see, let's see who else is around. Hey, Roxana, how are you? Hi, teacher, how are you? I'm fine. I'm just Thanks. fine, just fine. How was your day? Well, it was very interesting because uh, now I have some trainees with a new co-worker. Okay. And I have to do the training. Oh, really? And, yeah, because- I have to give. Yeah, I, 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 give I, I give. I have to give I, the training. And I have some meetings and check some reports and that's it. Everything is okay. Maybe we'll be better tomorrow. Okay. Easy day for tomorrow. I hope so. Let's hope so. Okay, guys, let's see, let's see, let's see. Before anything else happens, I need to start getting uh, uh, um, the attendance the soon as possible. So just give me a second. Let's see. Okay, let's see. Well, Ambar Elial Faro Gomez, say present, please. Present. Thank you. Uh, Claudia Lisette Ramos Barrientos. Okay. Daniel Eduardo Segura Valencia. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Thank you, Francisco. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. Lucero Abigail Godínez López. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. Marta Anabelinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Natanael Ayala Aristondo. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Oscar Ricardo Alvarenga Rodríguez. Roxana Iveta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Thank you. Janira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present. Claudia Elizabeth Ramos Barrientos. Otras veces he hecho así, pero cuando me siento demasiado. Pero está bien. Thank you. So, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, guys, let's start with our activity. Remember that right now, I mean, I just make a little conversation with the ones who connect early just to give them the rest, the chance to, to connect. And then we start working. So, let's see. What are we gonna do? Okay, the activity is as follows. Today, the first activity, you're going to be working with somebody just in pairs. You're going to tell the other person, what did you do today? How was your day? The regular activities. And also you're going to explain to the other person, what do you do in your company? So 
How was your day and the activities you perform at your company, okay? Then, well, right now, just that. Remember, you're going to tell the other person uh, like this. You're going to go like this. Hello, my name is Douglas and I am a nurse teacher. Today was a good day. I was teaching uh, before morning. Then in the afternoon, I had to do some errands. And let's see, in my job, well, I teach classes, I teach English, and I have to prepare classes. Right now, we are in the process of getting, uh, of ending the year at school. So that's different. I am preparing a project for a, for a city hall that I'm going to start on Saturday morning. And I'm also preparing a, a program that I'm going to develop with a student from SN. So I'm being busy. Okay, that's what you're going to do to express. Now, you will have four minutes. I want you to talk to each other to explain what do you do and how was your day, okay? Those are the two questions. What do you do? How was your day? So let me create the groups and send you to working groups. Remember, four minutes and that's it. You're going to be working just in pairs. Please guys, jump in. Time starts running right now. Let's go check on the groups. Uh, yeah, it's a uh, Inish, you know, uh, begin the beginning of the weekend. <laughs> the week. The yes. week. The week. I don't know. All right. I did continue the process the yesterday, so it's a very, it's a very busy. Because you talk about uh, uh, company transportation, right? Yes, right. What did you say about it? Uh, excuse me, could you repeat me, please? Yeah, what did you say about your company's transportation? Um, you mentioned something about your company transportation, but I couldn't get it. Um, I don't understand. <laughs> I'm sorry. Can you can you hear me? Well, yes, yes, oh, yes. Yeah. Okay, you said something about your company's transportation, but I didn't understand. Okay. Sylvia wants to know what what do your company do related to transportation transition? Actually, Sylvia, he works at, at customs. Ah uh, yes, but yeah. And and what so, they do is scan scan uh, scan trucks, right? Very yes. What is scan? What is the meaning of scan? X-ray, X-ray, X-ray scan. Okay. Uh, it's a machine uh, that uh, generate a uh, X-ray, and then with a X-ray uh, that analyze the 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 good good. Or a t-shirt or yeah, the goose, the goose. Rice, memorize. No, it's more easy. No, because I forgot the specific activities in your work because it's not safe with me. 
Yeah, but uh, for, well, well, for me, it's more easy memorize than write. Uh, what do you think, teacher? What is more easy? Write the. What is Janina? What is? What What is my What is the best? Easier. Easier. What is easier? Write the idea. Wrote the idea or memorize. Depending on the person. Actually, it depends on the person. The thing is this, Janita, uh, people will think differently. And the way we think and the way we perceive the information is different. There are some people that they, they go by sight. They just need to see it to get it like already in their minds. There's some people who <laughs> really need to write it. There's some people who need to read it. In my case, I mean, I can read out loud information and if I read it out loud, that information, I don't get anything. I have to read it on my own, just with my mind. But if I read out loud, I don't get, I mean, really? I'm not, yes. I mean, I can read a long text, a big, big text. And that's not a problem for me. I studied uh, speech, uh, so that's not a problem for me, reading like that. But my problem is that I never memorize anything if I read it out loud. I don't remember it. Really? Yes. This is weird. I, I don't know. I, I read, I don't know where that is better read aloud because it's, more, it's easier to memorize. As I tell you, depending on the person. Yeah, yeah. In my case, I prefer uh, memorize, for example, in this case, we're talking, I memorize the principal activity and construe the sentence. That works for you. If I don't write it, it doesn't exist. <laughs> <laughs> my memory is for all my life, teacher. Okay. Well, let's go back to the main room, ladies. Okay, okay. Okay, let's see, everybody's here, right? Let's see. Hmm. Okay, 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 okay. Well, let's see, guys. Now, second part of the activity is as follows. I'm going to send you back in the rooms. You are going to be working with another person and the only thing that you're going to do is this. You're going to tell your partner not about yourself. The only information you're going to share with your partner is about what your other partner told you, okay? You're going to talk about what the other person told you. Like, let's see, Wilfredo, who did you work with? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, will you repeat it? Please who picture. were you working with? Uh, with, uh, I go, I told you with Walter. Okay, so Wilfredo is going to tell the next person just about Walter, not about yourself, okay? Okay. Is it clear, okay. guys, what you're going to do? Yes, perfect. Thank you. Yes, teacher. Yes. Excellent. Yes. Thank you. Appreciate it. Okay, groups are ready. Jump okay. in. Okay.
claims. La variable are different claims. And the claim uh, requirement. And if a procedure, the production. Procedure. Procedure. procedure a procedure, the production. Uh, a busy day because uh, he had to visit the production floor and check some machines production floors production floor yes and he told me that uh, he need to he needed to check some machines uh, change oil for some uh, machines and change ink to um, to the brand teacher how do you say eh, como william me dijo de que había cambiado la tinta para grabar la marca so i get he changed he changed ink to brand pero no sé cómo sería realmente eh, tiene apagado uh. To imprint the brand. Oh, to imprint is in print. Yeah, that's okay. That would be the word to imprint. Okay, thank you. And the other, the other uh, activity, activity. And so cases in platform. What else Maria Alejandra did today? She told me that it was a busy day because she had a lot of uh, cases in. Marta. Hi, teacher. Sí. Silvia told is, me. Uh, uh, <laughs> Silvia told me, I don't want to work with Marta. It's a problem Marta. with your connection. <laughs> with with no. her connection. connection. With her connection. With her connection. <laughs> yeah, no, Silvia told me, I will get out of this group. I don't want to talk to Marta. I'm no, I don't you. believe it, you, teacher. <laughs> I don't believe you. I don't believe I you. I don't believe you, you. Hello? Hi, Hello, Silvia. Silvia. Hi, I'm sorry, I got disconnected. <laughs> yes, I, I, I know, the, but, but the teacher is a, a bad boy. <laughs> I know, I know, I am. Thank you. Thank you very
Okay, let's see. We're just waiting for everybody to come back. Okay, guys, now you will have a slightly different activity. You have gotten information from two different persons, right? For next activity, you will have assigned eight minutes for the activity. You are going to be working in big groups, groups of five members per group. What are you going to do? You are going to tell your classmates about one of the two persons you work with. And you will be getting at least two sentences from your classmates about the persons they were working with. Why? Because I'm going to ask you about at least two of them, okay? So I'll have the names here and I will be asking you about two different persons. Are you ready to start? Yes? Do you understand me? Let me repeat yeah. these instructions. You're going to be working in groups of five members. You're going to be telling your classmates about one of the two persons you have worked with. Of the information your classmates provide you, you're going to take notes, okay? Because I'm going to ask you about that information they provide to you. So. Let's jump into the rooms. I'll be passing by. You will have eight minutes for this activity. Let's do it. You can stay here, Nicholas. Don't worry, okay? Hello, Sylvia. What were you saying? I was trying to explain about the activity. Okay, let's do it better. Okay, Sylvia, tell me about one of the persons you work with. Uh, I work with Francisco, mm -hmm. and I was asking Francisco about uh, his job position. He told me that he works for a custom, custom, and okay. he was explaining to me that it's a machine that can the wood, and that he is a maintenance operator. Also, he told me that. He, today he has the night shift so he's going to start to work at 9 p.m okay thank you very much now maria alejandra tell us about one of your classmates um, my partner was janira okay hey, tell us about janira <laughs> Janina told me um, she had a long day because a new, a new example, a new example, and oh my God, and when when the people need to resolve some situation or the people have. Uh, a client about some products and Maria Alejandra received some tickets to them. She has to resolve to the, 
to the customer about the problem. That's why it was very easy to do. She was checking some picture or some photo in the platform. Okay, this is this is my this is uh, Maria Alejandra's information. We're next. Okay. Who is next? William. Me, me uh, my partner as well. International, Lady Roxana. Eh, ah, porque, eh, porque, uh -huh. because, <laughs> because, because, because eh, you told mm -hmm. some activities eh, that eh, her that his eh, position. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Well, what seconds. about you, Amber? Hi. We are just waiting for everybody to come back. Okay, teacher. Thank you, Mr. Osorio. Fernando. Okay, let's see. Thank you very much, Roxana. You are the first one. Tell me about two of your classmates. Well, um, I was talking with uh, William and he told me that uh, he had a easy day. Okay. And he uh, visited the production floor. Okay. And some of their of his activities in in his company uh, is check uh, the machine, change oil, and change ink to imprint brand, and also forklift handling. Okay, perfect. And in uh, in my other group, we are talking with. Uh, we were talking with uh, Walter and Amber, and I, rem I remember that Walter told me that uh, about uh, Wilfredo. So Wilfredo is this Wilfredo uh, in in his company is uh, in charge. No, is in charge of design the packaging. So some of the position is prepare uh, some of the, of the activities, activities activities in his position is prepare are temp some, are. some remember remember plural some are some okay some of some of his activities are some of his activities are prepare templates about different preparing are preparing, preparing are preparing templates about different clients and uh, then they have to decide if it work like that or need more examples about uh, the templates and those teacher templates 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 okay and that's okay. it very well done. Oh, you, you, you know so much about my, my job. Yeah, that's oh. great. <laughs> well, Wilfredo, so good that you opened it great. your mic. Wilfredo, tell me about two of your classmates. 
Ah, okay. In the first session, I talked with, with Walter, and Walter was, uh, he was told me um, that he he was a busy, very busy day, because the her, his work it is like my 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 job, because he has to to make some template when the the customer needs a new product, and he is in charge to make a template, and. I told to Walter that in my case, in my company, when we have to make a new, uh, a new, we have to package a new product, product, we have to make a template too and send to the United States to some to get some approval to work it. Then, if in United States um, check the the template. Uh, they send a send an email uh, where they explain if the product needs some mejoras, improvements. Improvements. Yes, mm, but if is the template doesn't have some opportunities, they told us you can work. Okay, perfect. That's about you. Now tell me about one of your classmates. Who were you working with? Uh, with Janira. Okay, tell me about William. Janira. Mm, Janira and, and William and Osorio and Claudia, but we didn't finish the activity. Osorio oh. and William didn't tell us their activity. What, what okay, yes, tell me yes. tell me about Claudia. I'm pretty interested to know what does Claudia do. Teacher, I had a problem with the connection when Wilfredo and Janina mm -hmm. was speaking. We're speaking. We're speaking, sorry. Okay, no problem, no problem. Let's see, Claudia, then tell me, what do you do, Claudia? In, in this day. No, what do you do? When I ask you, what do you do? I'm asking about your regular activities. What's your occupation? Um, I, I was saying the academic report. Okay. And I create exam. I, I check the exam. I, I teach in all day. Okay. I, I, I check the, the email every day. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much, Claudia. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Maria Alejandra, talk to me. Tell me about two of your partners, please. Teacher, I talk about Janira. <laughs> Janira is a famous person in this class. Yeah, yeah she is, she is. She is very famous. <laughs> But you, you were working with somebody else. I work with, uh, with William, but William don't let me a lot of information okay, from Roxana. But in, in the last group, you were working with, let's see, Lucero, Marta, Silvia, and Susana, right? Yes, but I only talk. <laughs> and a little bit Susana and a little uh, for us for Janira <laughs> oh you were talking about Janira okay tell me about uh -huh. Janira what does she do Janira I think that Janira is a developer uh -huh. because she check some cases in platform receive uh -huh. an answer emails and receive a lot of go of development. Okay, interesting. Thank you very much. Thank you. Ambar, you've been very quiet tonight. Hello, Ambar, how are you? Hello, teacher, I'm fine, what about you? I'm just great, happy to have you here in class, Ambar. Please tell me about two of your classmates. Well, my first partner was Marta, she told me about her, she, her she. day. She told me 
about her day in her job. Okay. Uh, she told me her day was very busy and hard because she she had to do migration in okay. in her accounts in her company. Well, okay. uh, actually, is the same company for me. <laughs> okay. But, Yes, uh, she Who? told me. Yes, yes. Sorry, she told me uh, tomorrow she continue the process of migration in the company. Okay, excellent. Now, who else do you work with? Sorry? Uh, about who of your other classmates can you give me some information? Mm. I don't remember very well, but uh, in my last group, I worked with Roxana and Walter. Okay, did uh, they tell you about one of your classmates? Um, Roxana, she told me about her job. Her day was very easy because she training uh, to the new partner in her department. Okay, cool. Yes. Excellent, thank you very much, Amber. Thank you, teacher. Susana, tell me about one of your classmates, please. Uh, my partner is a Claudia Ramos, teacher. Okay, uh, and what does uh, Claudia she, do? She say, um, uh, to can examine on Saturday. Uh, okay. Uh, but is a teacher and the yes. a signature mathematic. Okay. Uh, she has uh, under the uh, one two house two 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 hundred. Okay. Uh, a student. Um, only hey, it's a, it's okay, a, that's fine that's fine that's okay don't worry that's okay William okay. your turn please tell me about one of your classmates okay teacher. Uh, my partner is Roxana okay she has support to intermediaries. Mm -hmm. and she create and modify self profiles. Okay. And she had a very busy day with her office college. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Okay. Now let's see, let's see. Walter, your turn. Okay, teacher, uh, my partner, uh, Fredo. Okay. Fredo um, and work uh, and position a packing design and prepare the templates, uh, the different the clay, the different the claim. Okay. And the claim and the same. clients. Client, excuse me. Decide and continue the for production or no production. And all my other partner is Fernando. Fernando okay. and tell me and Silvia. Uh, Silvia uh, she went to work and hostel. Palo Verde. Okay. In position the receptionist. Excuse me, receptionist. How do you say? Receptionist. Receptionist. Okay. Uh, I don't remember more. Okay, that's okay. Perfect. You did pretty well. Okay, guys. Now let's see. I got another question for you. 
we've been talking about testing products. Do you remember? Now, we have a question here assigned it to us. But actually, we got two questions. And I want you to answer the, these two questions. Let me get them for you on the chat. The questions are these. Why do you think it is necessary to test products before they are released to the market? And the second question, have you ever tested a product? Let's see, Jose Osorio, why do you think it is necessary to test products before they are released to the market? In my opinion, it is necessary to resolve some problems uh, in the product and, and test the resistance and the quality of the endurance, of the endurance, endurance, endurance. Yes. Okay, endurance of the materials and if the product is comfortable, for example, and another things, teacher. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Nice. Sylvia, what about you? Why do you think it is necessary to test products before they are released to the market? Uh, I think um, it's very important to test a product before it to be released in the market because we have to know if people like it or if there are some, um, if we can improve it. It's good to know if we can improve this product. Okay, excellent. So you see that questions, why do you think it is necessary to test products before they are released to the market and have you ever tested a product? Okay, guys. Now, working in pairs, I want you to answer those two questions. You will have just Two minutes to answer them. Two minutes is more than enough. It's quite, quite simple. So let's jump into the groups. Just let me see. Okay. Hurry up. You just got two minutes to ask and answer those questions. William, you left alone. I'll send you to another group, okay? Okay, thanks, teacher. Hello, teacher. Hello, Roxana. Nobody wants you. Okay. I'll send you to another group. I'll send you to another group. It's just okay. that uh, Nicolas is in a meeting right now at the pools. Uh, okay. Remember, he teaches over there. Yes. Yeah. 
Tell me, I'm tell me. Sorry with you. Need to know if we have to. Let's just wait for everybody to come back. Okay, let's see. Fernando, question for you. Uh, do you think it is necessary to test products for companies before they release it to the market? Fernando. I guess we are having problems with the the microphone. Okay, let's see. I got the question for somebody else. Let's see, let's see. Uh, I'll ask that question to Amber. Amber, tell me, do you think it is necessary for companies to do testing before they send a product out to the market? Yes, it's important because uh, uh, we can identify the improvements about the product in the future. Okay, excellent. What do you think about it, Wilfredo? It is, it is the, the, the most important activity in, in company around the world. Because if we are making airplane, and we didn't make some tests, the result would, could be um, fatal. 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 Yes, it's the same word. Okay. The same. It's, uh, it's homograph. It's written the same, but pronounced differently. Um, okay. Okay. That's why it is necessary to make some tests to produce the, uh, we have to, to make always, always uh, some tests because we can, we can discover if the product need, needs some, some improvement or make some uh, pieces or, or the, okay. uh, it, it, it is necessary to, to, because we can know what the people think about offer or demand, I guess. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Janita, what's your take on this topic, please? Well, teacher, I, I guess that is necessary, really necessary, because uh, a test before to launch or release a product, uh, can give you uh, uh, some answer, for example, uh, determine where is the best place for sales, the product, or who is your, your client. Uh, the, for example, determine age, um, I don't know how to say um, razas or race, 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 or another uh, thing that make a good idea to to produce 
uh, the product. And another thing that is important is the verify the quality after before to to release or, or launch a product. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Thank you guys. Let me please get the I think it's, wow, one hour went away already. That was fast actually. Let me get the attendance one more time. Amber Elia Alfaro Gomez. Present. Claudia Elizabeth Ramos Barrientos. Present. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. Thank you. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Lucero Abigail Rodríguez López. Present teacher, excuse me. No problem, Jose. Present Pero, teacher. Present thank teacher. you, Lucero, I appreciate it. Eh, María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Natanael Ayala Aristongo. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Oscar Ricardo Alvarenga Rodríguez. Roxana Ibeda Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Shanira Elizabeth Asensio Garcia. Present. Okay, guys. First of all, let me please apologize to you. I have promised you to give you the pronunciation of the conversations before we had them. And tonight we are having a conversation and I didn't send you the audio. Uh, I'm so sorry, my apologies. Yesterday I was not doing quite, get, quite well of my health. And believe me, I just finished a class and crashed down. I was running a little fever and a little bit of headache. I'm so sorry, but I promise for next time I'll do it. So the conversation, right now what we are going to do is this. I'm going to read the conversation twice, but you are not going to see it. I'm going to read it twice for you just to hear it, okay? So please pay attention. I'm going to be reading quite slowly. Okay, the conversation is between Alejandro and his dad. They are making decisions about testing the new Papa's sandwich. Okay. We are ready to test our new product. What do we do? First, I think the site and handling test will be the best option because it allows customers to see the product, feel it, smell it, and taste it. What about the other variables? Will the product be branded or not? I'll let you decide on that, son. Great. As for the metal, I was thinking about the monadic. Consumers will eat and taste our product first and then we'll rate it. I find it more coherent for our new product, the Papa Sandwich. You're learning, son. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about our potential customers, the prototypes, our target audience, marketing, etc. I repeat, we are ready to test our new product. What do we do? First, I think the site and handling test will be the best option because it allows customers to see the product, feel it, smell it, and taste it. What about the other variables? Will the product be branded or not? I'll let you decide on that, son. Great. As for the method, 
I was thinking about the monadic. Consumers will eat and taste our product first, and then we'll rate it. I find it more coherent for our new product, the Papa's Sandwich. You're learning, son. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about our potential customers, the prototype, our target audience, marketing, etc. Okay. Now I'm going to show you the conversation. It's on your manuals. Oops. It's on your manuals on page number 20. The conversation goes like this. Remember, the situation is this. The conversation is between Alejandro and his dad. They are making decisions about testing the new Papa sandwich. If you remember, this is the second part of the conversation. The first one we saw it a few classes ago. Okay, I sent you already a picture of the conversation for the ones who got troubles like switching screens. And it goes like this. We are ready to test our new product. What do we do? First, I think the site in handling test will be the best option because it allows customers to see the product, feel it, smell it, and taste it. What about the other variables? Will the product be branded or not? I'll let you decide on that, son. Great. As for the method, I was thinking about the monadic. Consumers will eat and taste our product first and then we'll rate it. I find it more coherent for our new product, the Papa Sandwich. You're learning, son. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about our potential customers, the prototype, our target audience, marketing, etc. Okay, guys, now. Working in pairs, let's see. Groups are created, please jump in. You will have three minutes for the practice. Teacher, sorry. Yes, Claudia? What do you pronounce? Variables. 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 In yep. co coherent? Coherence. Coherent. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, okay. hold on. Thank you, teacher. Uh -uh. Yeah, coherent. Coherent. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Hey, Hi, teacher. They left you alone? Yes. Who is my partner? I think Walter. Walter is having problems with connection. I'll send you to another group. No problem. Okay. Oh, there's oh, Walter. There is Walter, right. Now. <laughs> now there. <laughs> okay, no problem. Hello. Hello. Okay. Uh, I am going to start. Okay. We are we are ready to test our new product. What do we do? First, I think the sign and handling test will be the best option because it allows customer to see the product, feel it, smell it, and taste it. What about the other variable, variables? Will the product be branded or not? I am left to decide on that one. Great. As for the method, I was thinking about the monadic customers will eat and taste, test our product first, and then we'll rate it. 
I find it more coherent for our new product. The Papa Sandwich. You're learning some. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about our potential customers. The prototype, our target audience, marketing, etc. Okay. Okay, I start. We are ready to test our new product. What do we do? First, I think the site and handling test can be the best option because it allows customers to see the product, feel it, to smell it, and test it. What about the other variabilities? Will the variables. 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 Will the products be branded or no? Or not? I'll let you know. I'm sorry. I will let you decide on that, son. Great. As for metal, I was thinking about the monadic. Customers will eat and taste our product first, and then we'll write it. I find it more current for our new product, the Papa Sandwich. You're learning, son. You're learning, son. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about our potential customer, the customers, the prototype, our target audience, marketing, etc. We are ready to test our new product. What do we do? First, I think the sign and handling test will be the test option because it's allowed. Sign. sign. I think the sign and handling test will be the best option because it allows cost customers to see the product, feel it, smell it, and taste it. What about the over variables? Will the product be brand or not? Will that you decide on that song? Great. As for the metal, I was thinking about the monadic consumers will will eat and test our product first, and then we'll rate rate it. I find find it more current for our new product, the Papa Sandwich. You're le you're learning, son. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about our potential customers to the prototype or target our audience, marketing, etc. Okay, <laughs> I start. I start this time. Okay. okay. We are ready to test our new product. What do we do? First, I think we sign, sign and handle test would be the best option because it allows customers to see allows. the product. Allows, 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 allows customers allows. to see the product, feel it, smell it, and test it. What about the, the other variables? Will the product be branded or not? I let you decide on that song. Great. As for the metal, I was thinking about the monarchy. Consumers will eat and taste our product first, and then we'll rate it. I think it more co co <laughs> coherent. Teacher, coherent. Yes, coherent. Okay, I think it more coherent. Excuse me, teacher. Uh, um, on. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't know why it kicked you out of the group. No sé por qué me lo sacó del grupo, del sistema. Aquí está con Nicolás, con Nicolás, pero no no, no. no, no, He doesn't have a microphone right now. Ah, ok. Yo estuve practicando solo, teacher. Thank you. No problem, Walter. We are going to do the exercise. Don't worry. Everybody's okay. coming back now.
Okay, let's see who's going to be first. Susana and Wilfredo. So let's see, Susana, you'll be Alejandro. Teacher. Okay. Will you share yes, please the text? Will you share please the reading? Oh, sure. Let please, me do it. Because I can see well in my cell phone. Perfect, no problem. Let's see. There you go. Can you speak now? Yes, sir. Thank you. I are you star? I no, start. Susana. Ah, okay, Susana okay, okay, okay. <laughs> we are ready <coughs> to test our product. What do we do? First, I think the sign and handling test will be the best option because it is allows customers to see the product, feel it, smell it, and test it. What about the other variables? Variables? Variables. Will the product be a brand or not? I let you decide on that song. Great. As for the merit, I was thinking about the monody. Customer will eat and taste our product first, and then we'll rate it and find it's more coherent in our new product, the Papa Sandwich. You are learning, son. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about or potential customer, the prototype or target audience, marketing, etc. Okay, marketing, etc. Thank you, Amber and Claudia. Uh, Amber, you'll start, please. Okay, we are ready to test our new product. What do we do? First, I think the sign and hand the test will be the test option because, because it allows customers to see the product, feel it, smell it, and test it. What about the other variables? Will the product be branded or not? I let you decide on that song. Great. As for the method, I was thinking about the monadic. Consumers will eat and taste our product first and then we'll rate it and find it more coherent for our new product, the Papa's Sandwich. You're learning soon. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about our potential customers, the products or our target audience, marketing, etc. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Fernando and Francisco. Fernando, you'll start, please. Okay, teacher. We are ready to test our new product. What do we do? The side and handling test will be the best option because it allows customers to see the product, feel it, smell it, and taste it. What about the other variables? Will the, will the product be branded or not? I let you decide on that, son. Great. As for the method, I was thinking about the monadi. Consumers will eat and taste our product first, and then we'll rate it. I find it more coherent for our new product, the Papa's Sandwich. You are learning sound. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about our potential customer, the product, our target audience, marketing, etc. Okay, perfect. Consumers, Fernando. Consumers. And Francisco, discuss. Discuss. Jose Osorio. No, thanks to you guys. Jose Osorio and Lucero. Jose, you'll start, please. Okay. Okay. We are ready to test our new product. What do we do? 
First, I think the site and handling test will be the best option because it allows customers to see the product, feel it, smell it, and taste it. What about the other variables? Will the product be branded or not? I let you decide on that one. Great. As for the middle, I was thinking about the monarid. Consumers will eat and taste our products first, and then will rate it. I find it more coherent for our new product, the Papa Sandwich. You're learning, son. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about our potential customers, the prototype, our target audience, marketing, etc. Okay, perfect. Variables, Mr. Variables. Variables. Thank you very much. Maria Alejandra and Marta. Maria Alejandra, you start. Okay. We are ready to test our new product. What we what do we do? Here's a team design and handle test would be the best option because it allows customers to see the product, feel it, smell it, and test it. What about the other, the other variables with the product be rendered or not? I let you decide on that song. Great. As for the middle, I was thinking about the moniaris Consumers will eat and taste our product first, and then and then will rate it. I I find it more coherent for our new product, the Papa Sandwich. You're learning so We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about our potential customer, the the prototype or target audience, merchandise, etc. Okay, perfect. Target audience, audience, Martha. Thank you, teacher. Now let's see, Roxana and Sylvia. Roxana, you start, please. Okay. Sorry. We are ready to test our new product. What do we do? First, I think the site and handling test would be the best option because it allows customers to see the product, feel it, smell it, and test it. What about the other variables? Will the product be branded or not? I would let you decide on that, huh? Great. As for a metal, I was thinking about the monadic. Consumers will eat and taste our product first, and then will rate it. It feel it. I feel sorry. I feel it more coherent for our new product, the Papa's sandwich. You're learning, son. We have so much to work. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about our potential customers, the prototype our target audience, marketing, etc. Okay, perfect. Very well done, ladies. Now, let's see. Walter and Wilfredo. Walter, you... Oh, I'm sorry, Wilfredo did it already. Walter and William. Walter, you'll start. Walter, I think Walter is having problems with the connection. Let's see, uh, Shanira, can you help William, please? Okay, teacher. So let's see. 
uh, William starts. Okay. We are ready to test our new product. What we do? do? First, I think. Pardon, the what do we do? First, I think the sign and handling test will be the test option because it's allowed customer to see the product, feel it, smell it, and taste it. Well, about the other bar oils, will the product be rendered or no? I led to the site on that song. Great, I for the matter, I was thinking about the monadic consumers will eat and taste our product first, and they will write it. I find a more coherent for our new product, the Papa Sandwich. You're learning some. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about potential customer, the product, our target audience, marketing, etc. Thank you very much. Target, target. Okay, now guys, look, we have here two questions. What type of test do they decide to, to apply? What testing method will they implement for the Papa sandwich and why? And what are the next decisions Alejandro and his dad will take about testing the new Papa sandwich? Okay, these questions you are going to be uh, answering as it says here as a pair work. You will have just two minutes. It's quite easy to solve this. And then you're going to give me the information. I will choose three of you to give me the information. As I told you, uh, let's see, let me stop share. Three minutes is enough for this activity. So let me get the groups. Uh, they are recreated already. Please jump in. Okay, perfect. I went to the group. But check on another group. It's the method that they implement for the Papa's sandwich and why? Hello, Francisco. Hello, tell me. Okay, question two. Was did it in less than one? Up. Okay. Uh -huh. We finished, teacher. We finished. Ready? That's cool. I'll see you in the main room. Okay.
Oops. Let's see, let's see. Claudia, tell me what type of test do they decide to apply? Maybe monadic test. Okay. They say the first says the site enhancing test will be the best option. Okay. And then monadic test. Thank you, Claudia. Okay. Now let's see. What testing method will they implement for the Papa sandwich and why? What testing method, uh, Roxana? Well, uh, he will apply the monadic because consumers will eat and taste the product first and then will uh, rate, it, rate it and find it more current for the product. Coherent. Coherent, sorry. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. And let's see, what are the next decisions Alejandro and his dad will take about testing the new Papa's sandwich? Marta? They need to a specific target uh, audience. Uh, the prototype their marketing strategy, etc. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Perfect. Now, guys, we are going to do a different type of exercise right now. Okay. Uh, I will divide you into groups. And I will be giving each group a different question, okay? Like two different questions for you to ask each other. We are going to start having different type of conversations, specific conversations, okay? So let me try the exercise. I know you will enjoy it, okay? I will divide you into groups and I will be sending you the questions group by group because each group will have different. Well, no, the first time we'll do something. The first time we will do the same questions, but for next classes, I will be giving you a different questions, okay? Perfect. The first two questions that we are going to be working with will be the following ones, okay? Look, what have been the best moments of your life so far, so far, hasta este momento, okay? Could you tell me about your family? Those two questions you are going to be asking each other. So let me recreate then groups. Groups are created, please jump in. Let's do it. Okay, let's go check on them groups. Who been the best moment of your life so far? And could you tell me about your family? Okay. 
my best moments have been when my my daughters were born and they have been the, the most important events of my life. I pray. Um, my first, my first daughter. Uh, but I, um, I live, I live, uh, experience, uh, for, for mother. This is a my best moment experience. Um, on my house and played a lot and enjoyed the time and didn't didn't get a, a big problem then. Oh. This, this is by me. What about you, Francisco? Oh, In my case, uh, I consider uh, we have uh, many, many best moments, and uh, I every every time uh, I, I yes, yes, the thing good. I have a beautiful family. I had understanding and fall so far. How many childs do you have? One baby, one daughter. One daughter, okay. Yes. Okay. okay. How are you? Sorry? No, we didn't hear. Okay, let's see, everybody's coming back. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Fernando, tell me what have been the best moments of your life so far? Uh, teacher, I think that the best moment in my life were, uh, had been when my children were born. Okay, excellent. Could you tell me about your family, Fernando? Uh, my family, I love my family. I, I live with my wife and my two children children's okay. and I will I work from home but but I share my day with my with my children because I am home all the day okay. and all day long I am all, home day long. all day long all day long okay and I I share with with them uh, the lunch the, the the breakfast the dinner so all day long the pandemic has benefited me Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Now let's see, Shanira, tell me what have been the best moments of your life so far? 
Well, teacher, I was happy and I didn't know. <laughs> when I was when I was a teenager, maybe 12 or 13 years old, uh, I, I had a lot of friends and played basketball I, and I played basketball every afternoon and visited their house or my house and played a long games like uh, Domino or Uno or another game. Was was a really happy time for me. Okay, perfect, excellent. Now let's see, let's see, let's ask uh, Maria Alejandra, what about you? Tell me, what have been the best moments of your life so far? I think teacher that my best moment or experience um, was when I when I moved to live alone. <laughs> I live alone from 20 years when I have 20 years maybe like this. When I turned 20 or when I when I was 20. well when I was 20. When I was 20, um, I did many things uh, and realized a lot of things. <laughs> and, my, and my parents give me a lot of confianza. I don't know. <laughs> um, trust. Trust. Uh, a lot of trust. And only that. <laughs> okay, perfect. Perfect. Excellent. Now, let's see, guys. Now, we're going to go back as, as small groups and you're going to answer just one question. What are you like as a person? In this case, you're going to be working again in small groups. Okay, let's see. And you're going to be working in in the small groups, but there's going to be like a moderator. First group is going to be Amber, Francisco, and Roxana. Amber, you're going to be asking your classmates, what are you like as a person? Second group, Marta and Silvia. Marta, Nicolás, and Silvia. Marta, you'll do the asking. Third group, Fernando, Susana, and Janira. Uh, Fernando, you are in charge of asking or collecting the information. Group number four, Claudia, Maria Alejandra, and William. Claudia, you will be asking the questions. And group number five, Jose, Walter, and Wilfredo. Jose, you will ask the question, okay? You will have just two minutes to answer that question. What are you like as a person? You are going to describe yourself, okay? Hurry up, guys.
persona muy estresada. Yes, stressful. Ok. Well, what about you, Francisco? What, what are you like as a person? Hello, Amber. Hello. What are you like as a person, Francisco? Well, uh, I consider uh, I am uh, uh, amigable, is friendly. Yes. Yes. Uh, I am a friendly people. Uh, I am a responsible. Uh, uh, I uh, I like. Uh, Uh, talking uh, with all, all people. Um, how do you say Ovarena? <laughs> Homely. 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 Yeah, okay. like this. I consider it. Homely. I am I am homely. Just that. Okay, let's see. Wilfredo, tell me, how are you as a person? What are you like as a person? I'm okay, teacher. I, we were talking about kind of person we are. And I told to my, my classmate that I, I guess that I'm a, a friendly person. It is easy for me to get some friends over there playing soccer when I, I when I uh, was studying in the university in the high school and then um, I always I always um, over there making a joke I I can say that I I'm a joking joker okay. and then when the situation re required or it is necessary, I can be very, very, very serious person too. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. What about you, Fernando? Tell me, what are you like as a person? Um, I am a, a, I am a friendly person. I, I try to be a funny person and I try to do my best effort every day. I try to help anybody that I can. And Sometimes I am angry. I am a father of two children. Uh, sometimes it's necessary. Yes. I understand you. I understand you. So let's see the person that nobody knows in this group. Janira, tell me, what are you like as a person? Well, teacher, I explained to my partner that I'm very different in this class because I I stay behind my monitor, but in face to face, I'm an introvert and quiet person, and I very pragmatic and angry too. I very angry. Marta, okay. Marta, confirm this. <laughs> okay, thank you. So let's see. What about you, Sylvia? Tell me, what are you like as a person? Um, I am 
uh, happy person. I'm very kind, very polite. Um, I am honest. I like to study, and I'm very de dedicated at work. Um, also, I am honest and I like to be very friendly with the people. Okay, perfect. Thank you. What about you, William? Tell me, what are you like as a person? Okay. Uh, me, a streak with my, with myself. Uh, too serious but friendly. We responsible. Uh, very uh, always. I have very attitude. Okay. Re respectful. Okay. Excellent. Respectful. Great. Thank you very much, Walter. Your turn. Tell me, what are you like as a person? Oh my God, uh, Walter is a person. Is and um, I had a problem. Uh, for me, you don't know matter. Is is that not better? Is that not better? Um, and always, and I had a um, smile in my face. Okay, thank you. Let's see, Susanna. What about you? What are you like as a person? Tell me. Um, I am. I funny. Okay. I am friendly. Okay. I am obedient. Okay. <laughs> and I am little strict. 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 Okay. Excellent. Thank you very much, Roxana. What about you? Don't tell me serious, please. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm really serious person, but I consider that all the time I try to be proactive and responsible and a little hungry. And all okay. the time I, ha I, angry? I am- Angry or ang hungry? Angry. Okay, oh, I can believe that. Yes, and all the time I am stressed about all things. Everything. Everything. And that's it. Thank you. Appreciate it. Okay. Ambar, tell me, what about you? What are you like as a person? Well, in my case, I am a person uh, of few words, and I'm in I am impatient. Okay. And I I on I am honest person too. Perfect. Thank you. Maria Alejandra, the serious one. Tell me. Yes. <laughs> Teacher, I think that I uh in sorry and friendly person. I'm very angry angry city angry um, for a lot of situations <laughs> and only that i think i very demanding with myself but only that <laughs> okay perfect okay guys let's see believe it or not the time's up so let me get the final attendance please Second, so I get it ready. Amber Alfaro Gomez. Present. Claudia Lisa Ramos Barrientos. Present, teacher. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Here. Fernando Marvin Gonzalez Martinez. Present. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejia. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present, teacher. Lucero Abigail Godinez López, María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. 
Thank you. Marta Navelinda Morales de Portillo. Yes, Present teacher. Eh, Natanael Ayala Aristondo. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Oscar Ricardo Alvarenga Rodríguez. Roxana Iveta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Thank you. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Thank you, Present. Silvia. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present, teacher. Thank you. Thank you, Francisco. I got you. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present, teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present, teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Chamira Elizabeth Asensio Garcia. Present. Perfect. Hey guys, I really enjoyed this class. Very interesting. Thank you very much. I hope to see you tomorrow. And I hope you enjoy the exercises we do today. Yes, we do, teacher. Have a good, good night. night. Have a good night. Take care. Good, uh, good night. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Good night to you all. Uh, good night. Good night. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Hello, Martha. How are you? Hi, teacher. I'm good. What about you? I am just fine, Martha. Did you and feel better? Well, sort of in a way. I feel kind of, you know. Yesterday, I, I, a little bit of a the, headache. I have this, this same symptom because I have two, two, do, two doses. You will see. Okay. I, I have so, the, the same symptom of the so fiber. You, know, you know what I'm talking about now. Yes. Okay, let's see. Let's see, Marta. Uh, I want you to work in a little bit in something very specific. Okay, okay. Teacher, tell me. Uh, did I tell you the other time about how to get to the recursos académicos in the platform? The grammar, pronunciation, vocabulary? No, teacher, I'm so sorry, but I fail. I, I don't know this learning in this part. Okay, let me do something then. Okay, let's see. Let me know if you can see my screen, please. Okay. Okay. Well, here we got the, the, the sections, right? And you work in the in the platform. Yes, yes. Here, here you come down to Centro de Ayuda. You see okay. it down here? Yes, I see. You click on it and you come here to Recursos Académicos. Then you click on Grammar. and you come to intermediate grammar. Okay. Okay? Okay, So I got it. I need you to please work in this. Must have got, may, my, could, and can in number 11 and number five, please. Okay, teacher, I got it. I would like you to review those exercises. Because, I mean, you got enough vocabulary, but I would like you to start speaking in more complex sentences. Okay. okay. And that's going to help you a lot, believe me. So, models help you to express in a better way. Now, I would like you to do something. Check it out slowly, okay? Check it out slowly on your own time, and let me know when you have checked it out. And if you need some extra exercises, perhaps to practice more, let me know and I will help you with that. 
Is that okay for yes. you? Yes. Yes, I know. Thank you, teacher. Okay. No, no, no problem. That's my requirement. Now you tell me, is there something from the classes that you would like to, you would like me to explain perhaps a little bit more? Okay. In, in case is, is so good for me because he, my problem is um, the, the connection, uh, for example, to being, I, I did so learn the recursion academic is uh, very important for clear, clear this part. Okay. Because I, 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 I know I have a problem with, with the connector, the, the sentence. With connectors? Yes. Okay. Remember, I don't mostly... Know mostly they are adverbs and it depends i mean connectors depend on the situation you try to explain like if you're saying time you use expressions of time like then after next okay yes and well with connectors what i will recommend you to do is this pick one choose one one day okay Okay. And along the day, I mean, you can perhaps, you work from home, right? Yes. Okay, so I imagine you got post-its, right? Okay, yes. Okay, write the connector, post it next to your computer. Okay. And, and along the day, try at least to make three sentences where you use connectors, just three, okay? All along the day, you will see it there, you will make one sentence, okay, on your mind. Okay, excellent. Remember, teacher. a long sentence. Keep on doing exercises related to some situations, perhaps from your job, perhaps from your house. Like, imagine you are working, you see the connector and you say, and the connector you are using is next. Okay. You say, oh, I will finish working at 12. Then I will prepare lunch. Next, I will have my lunch. You see, you use it once. Yes. Okay. okay. Simple, simple sentence. Yeah, yeah. But yes, the connector. The idea is that your mind gets used to use the connector. Learn all time. Yes. Excellent. Tips, teacher. No, I promise I do. <laughs> do it and let me know okay yes yes I let know I practice the tips you give me the the, the sentence all day is is very important uh, repeat for layer for me I I, I think so yeah, I mean, remember, practicing, uh, practicing is very, very important. And that's okay. the, actually, that's the only way where we learn vocabulary, we learn expressions and everything. Yes, it's very important. The, the advice, uh, do you give me any other um, meeting? It's about the watch uh, movies with a uh, subtitle so in, in English. I, I think so it's a very good practice because I understand more the dialogue in the, in the movie. Yeah, that's actually very good and very important when we are able to do that, to check out the vocabulary, to check out the dialogues, to understand everything. And by reading, it helps us a lot because at the same time we are getting the listening, we are watching the words and we are getting context. That's something special. At this level that you are now, you understand the conversation. So you yes. also get the context. And that's something quite interesting. Hi guys, hold on. Um, 
it's raining, but let's see. No. Oh, so, or... so that's very, very important that you that you understand, you get the vocabulary and you get it in context. That's that's great. And that's why for some people it helps them a lot, like to get the vocabulary from movies because they see it in a context. It's not the same when you just see a simple sentence, okay? And that's why I'm asking you to do the exercise on your own at home with a little post-it related to normal activities you perform, okay? Okay, okay, teacher. I appreciate your advice for me. Okay. Thank you very much, Marta. It Thank was a you, pleasure. Andrew. And if Thank you got sure. any question, let me know. Yes, I I know too. But it, for this moment, is it's okay. I promise the learn uh, the the task. Um, uh, I I I promise. Uh, Continue learn for for you. It's very important. Remember, uh, and it's a pleasure for me to be working with you, Martin. Thank you for your help, teacher. No problem. A pleasure. Have a good night. Take care. <laughs> see, see you tomorrow. See you. Okay, that was today's class. See you tomorrow.